finally got this stuff. I've been wanting it for a while, just hadn't been able to get myself to pull the trigger. But I finally got it. This uh, Equip Prime Protein Chocolate Grass-Fed Beef Isolate Powder. As it says there, there are four ounces of grass-fed beef per scoop. Beef Isolate, Coke, Cocoa, and Stevia. So, let's see what this is in, what's in this. Um, here it is, ingredients. Like I said from the front, grass-fed beef protein, cocoa powder, and stevia extract. <clears throat> All right, there are about 30 scoops in this bag. Um, each scoop is 100 calories. It's half a gram of fat, two total carbs, one is fiber, and uh, 21 grams of protein. Um, there's 44% of your B12, uh, 38 milligrams of phosphorus, 145 milligrams of sodium, 275 milligrams of potassium in here as well. Um, it says you can add it to your smoothies and shakes, add it to eight to 10 ounces of any beverage, add to your recipes, um, and fresh baked goods. Get you some, uh, get you some extra protein in though, uh, without a lot else being in there other than the protein. Uh, I'll show you the video. I tried this yesterday, actually. Um, and then again this morning. Yesterday, I'll show you the video of me and Jennifer tasting this yesterday. The reason I wanted the chocolate is because I really like Keto Chow chocolate shakes with the uh, peanut butter uh, perfect keto uh, collagen mixed in. And it gives it kind of that Reese taste, and that's the reason I liked it. And so I tried this just with almond milk and a little bit of cream. I tried it with... Uh, the same way but adding some of the peanut butter collagen. And then I had a full thing of it with uh, with just this and almond milk and the collagen. Those are the three ways I did it. I think most of the time I'll probably just be having this with almond milk though. Um, and you'll see why in the video as well. I'm gonna give us a try. This is just almond milk, a little bit of cream, and the chocolate protein powder. Nothing else added. That's really good without even the peanut butter and it's not even that cold. That's a good drink. That's pretty good. Hey, do you like it? She can't stop drinking it long enough to tell us if she likes it, so it must be good. See, it got through this hole. See, can I have a drink? Mm -hmm. Let him try it. I got more for you to try. I got something else for you to try. Hey, did you like it? What does it taste like, Sandy? It's like a chocolate shake. See, that goes in the front. <laughs> okay. I put it backwards. What do you think? I don't know. It, it tastes good, but it tastes like chocolate. It's supposed to taste like chocolate. <laughs> it almost tastes like a chocolate milk, huh? Is it good? What you put in it? Peanut butter collagen. It has peanut butter with it. It's chocolate and peanut butter. Chocolate. Chocolate and peanut butter, yeah. Okay. Hey. Hey, guys, sit with me. You, you don't like it? I do. A little bit. You like, you like it better without the chocolate, without the peanut butter? Yeah. All right, now I'll try it with some peanut butter collagen also added.
I love that. I like these mixed together. This is the way I intended to drink it most of the time anyway. <clears throat> I think it might be better this way in the morning though. It's pretty frothy and not as cold as I'd like. So I did have one of these this morning after it sat in the fridge and got that frothiness going. And I do think it's better without the frothiness, but this is the, uh, this is the, the chocolate protein powder um, mixed with the perfect keto collagen. And I do think this is really good mixed together, but I think this is a stronger chocolate taste maybe. Maybe there's not as much liquid, something. This is maybe more of a chocolate, stronger chocolate taste than like keto Chell's chocolate taste or I don't know. But the peanut butter taste from the perfect keto collagen doesn't come through as much in this so it's not as Reese cuppy as I like to call it and I think that this is just going to be drink most of the time for me by itself just mixed with almond milk without the peanut butter collagen I'll do I'll drink my collagen separately I think from this instead of mixing it together but um yes I'm very happy with this stuff um, I was worried about the taste because at to this point, the only, the only, uh, protein powder I'd really found on keto that I liked was keto chow. So I wasn't sure that this was even going to taste good, but I think this tastes pretty good.